Hello and welcome back to Siberia, the world before. I played the demo last week and absolutely fell in love with the game and it seems like a couple of you would have really liked to see more of it so I have purchased the full um, game and it, now we're ready to jump in. I do think it's going to start me off at the very beginning so I'm going to have to play through the sections that were in the demo but that's okay. I kind of wanted to do that anyways. So yeah it looks like we only have a new story and a new game so yeah okay here we go we'll be starting out getting ready to in in Vagen, i believe it's called yeah in the streets of Vagen, heading up to play our first um little uh con concerto i guess I am going to be skipping through like quite a lot of it just to get to the newer section as I can though though there was one side quest I did not complete during the demo and I would like to try and do that this time. I did absolutely fall in love with the story and I am so curious to find out how this all plays out between um, the two different protagonists and what each one is going to have to do with the other somehow <laughs> across the centuries right or across the years i do love these mechanical men they look amazing i wouldn't mind having one come in and help me around the house <laughs> to be honest with you they can put books away for me organize all my cookbooks dang it I am a not much for classical music, but that song, I really like it. I like the music for this game. And that is a cool little trolley. <laughs> Right, we are in the spring of 1937, and this is our, our character, Dana, I believe her name is. I need to hurry. Frau Beckmann said she will be waiting for me on the square at the top of the main street. Yep. So we are just going to day today. definitely hey, head up there. Herr Baumgartner's bakery. We usually love the place. Everybody does at the academy. That bread looks amazing, I have I'm to say. I'm too nervous to eat a strudel. <laughs> hurry along to the square. You don't want to be late. Not I today. I definitely of all don't want to be late today. So the square is up this way, though we do have that little, the little detour section that we are going to take very quickly. She is, uh, what was it? Or well, I guess we can't run yet. <laughs> or we can't walk fast, right? R2 to walk faster. There we go. Now we got to trot on. And I will look at the. Yeah, here's our ob secondary objectives, so make sure we do those first. So I am hmm. going to look at the, Not bad our, at all. the photo. I wonder if Papa would sell it in his shop, though. Painting, sorry, not photo. And then if we head over this way with the guy who tells us about the kids, right? Yeah, over here. Goodness, a rock? Oh, no. Vandals. Are you all right? None for the worse for wear. What worries me is it's getting worse every day. That's what my father says. Never mind, eh? <laughs> Always look on the bright side. At least, it's prompted me to make some repairs that I've been putting off. Do you know who did this? I've got a good idea, yes. Good for nothing hoodlums. I see who you mean. They only feel big and strong when they're together, though. Right. But people like that can be dangerous when they're driven by an ideal. 
Especially when it's based on hate and rejection of other cultures. And they hold no love for Vagarans, that's for sure. My parents and I are Vagarans. Well, in that case, I wish you well. Troubled times are these, young lady. For people like us. Ah, enough talk of nastiness. Ah. I see you're carrying a music case. Would you be the lucky young lady who's to enchant our ears this year? I am. Um, and I should go. It's nearly time. Well, let me congratulate you first. Music is one of the few pleasures left to us nowadays. So, thank you, Fraulein. Thank you for spreading it around. Would you like to do me the honor of writing something in the cement before you go? I'll... I'll add the date like they do in Hollywood. It's all the rage these days, you know. Well, I... Unless you're worried, it would make you late. Alright, so last time we drew a swan and I think I want to draw a All swan right. this time. I will. Here you go. <laughs> I'm just ah, wondering if we'll lovely. see this later in the, the game. Great white swan of Vagan. The immortal symbol of our beautiful town. A very fine inscription indeed, and one that will no doubt be here for many years to come, whatever may become of us now. Thank you, mein Herr. I really should go now if I don't want to be late at the Music Academy. I'll be listening from here. Thank you. Goodbye. And that was the broken window, right? What's the point of damaging books? It's yeah. disgraceful. It is Same very thing happened disgraceful. Last month to the shop of Papa's friend, Herr Zimmer. Hmm. Okay, so in the demo, I didn't go back this way, but now I'm curious, and I really regret not going back here. I thought maybe. The ghetto. Mama mm. and Papa often talk about it when they think I'm not listening. They say that more and more Vagarians are being forced to live here. Anyway. I'd better not hang around or I'll end up being late at the square. Hmm. So I thought maybe... Parallel investigation. So I got a trophy for looking at that. Can I... I cannot talk to her. And I don't think I can... Continue on. So I wonder... If that was enough... To complete the side quest. Maybe I just needed to look at that. We're going to find out. Is it that late already? Paul oh. Beckman will kill me if I don't get to the yep. square on time. Where am I going? <laughs> I'm definitely running the wrong way. I can tell you that. I thought I was turning. Who are these people? Go on. Hop it. Don't want your sort of hanging around here. Oh, wait. I saw something. Hold on. Interesting. The National Socialist Party of Ostertal. I think that's what Papa calls the brown shadow. Nothing but yobs in uniform, according to him. I'd better not hang around here. Yeah. I definitely don't think I want anything to do with that. Right? Yeah, okay, yeah, that's our... I was just checking. Yep, we better get out there. <laughs> Good yep. grief. Don't be nervous, you got this. I'm honestly kind of glad I have to replay this section because I absolutely Guten love Tag, Frau Beckmann. her musical oh, score Frau and, there you are. and how the clock reacts to it. It's more, and you would have been late. Please excuse me, Frau Beckmann, but uh, I was delayed on the way. May I have your convocation notice? And I don't think it popped up saying that I had to, um, that I didn't complete the, uh, 
Oh, there we go. That I didn't complete the side quest, so I think that's all Thank I had to do was go and look at the ghetto um, now, section. Now, remember, performing at the annual spring concert is a great honor and rewards the best music academy student of the year. So it is imperative that you show yourself worthy. I will do my best, Frau Beckmann. The piano is ready. Make this day yours, Dana Rose. Now we already know she's got this, but yeah, I can't wait to see this again. I enjoyed this section so much from the demo. So we need to, what, look up at the clock, I think it was, right? Yeah, there we go. We look there. That is such a pretty clock. It'll be all right. It'll be all right, Dana. You'll not make any mistakes, and they will come out of the tower. Come on, play something then. Oh, good grief. I'd better get started quickly. And then we can inspect this, and we learn how to uh, pull things down, so... All the way down. Everything's ready. All I need to do now is arrange my sheet music and begin. And we do that by putting her sheet music there. And then now we can get ready for the performance. I just admire all the... The Induit... It, uh, God, what's the word? I can't think... Yeah, like... Yep. Let's begin. I just admire all the work that goes into designing clocks. You know, it's just amazing. All, there's all those little tiny pieces and parts and bits and bobs that when combined in the right order just make the most beautiful things or most beautiful clocks, you know. And then to hook an organ up to it, too? Dang, that's some um, forethought. That's a beautiful new designed organ. Ingenuity, that was the word I was searching for. I knew it would come to me eventually. And then the animatronics on top of it, all combined up into a big, basically, cuckoo clock. Holy heck, how many years of planning and design did that take? Because you don't think of something like this overnight. Like, the idea might pop in your head of like, hey, this is what I want to make. But if you don't have the skill to bring the whole thing together, it won't, you know, It'll just amount to a beautiful idea that never bore fruit. I don't know why, but this just gives me chills watching this happen. It's so pretty. I didn't know it's just a video game, you can make it look like anything, but God, could you imagine if this was really a clock that you could go and see today? Oh man, that would be awesome. I would be there like all the time. <laughs>
And then now we are back to a winter of a 2004 in the salt mines. Not a good area. Not nice people in here. That would drive me insane if a guard came walking by my my recording room door banging their nightstick on it like that or like rubbing it on there I'd be like a cat in a a room full of rockers you know <laughs> so this is where I can consult my diary I, I can do that. Uh, let me see. I need to go back to the previous pages, I suppose. But, you know, if you want to read through this, I've already read it through in the demo. If you want to read through it, you can pause the video and, and read through. I'll start on the first page there. And then there was that one. And then there, that one. And it's just basically how she was over here looking for somebody. For Smith Walker, yeah, she's looking for our, our protagonist from the, was it 1930s, 1938, 39, something like that, 37. Yeah, I'm terrible with remembering things. All right, here we go, and then this is our little cellmate. Sleep okay? Like a bear. Yeah, I heard. Better get ready, Katusha. Mmm. I feel like I've been run over by a tank. Today's the day we're supposed to take over from Team Orange in Gallery C, right? Don't remind me. They say it's really tough. Isolated with no rescue party on hand. Which is crazy, because it's the worst gallery for cave-ins. We should get going, Katusha. I mean... What if the guard catches us slacking off when we should be ready? Who, Simona? She's no altar girl, but she's not the worst around here. True. But I will be ready in time to leave. I just want to get all the rest I can. You okay? Sure. Digging an assault mine 12 hours a day in the hope of finding a fragment of ivory? It couldn't be better. Don't let it get to you. Maybe I'm a fool, Kate. Maybe I should have listened to my folks. If I had stayed in line in the National Choir like a good little pawn instead of forming an anti-establishment punk group, I would not be here now. I'm glad I've got you, though. Listen, Katusha. We're going to get out of here, right? Yeah, right. If you say so. Come on, Katusha. Better get ready. Mm. Sure. Okay. Five minutes. No more. Da? Da. Yeah, I, you know, I'm wondering if they have a little bit more than a friendship going on. It it kind of feels that way to me. Not that that's a bad thing or anything. I'm just saying they feel like more than just roommates. All right, and then I've read those, so if you want to pause and read, there you go. That's the full thing. And we are back over here, and I oh yeah, that's right. We can take her. Her pick. Observing objects from every angle will give you. Is there okay? Okay. So did I miss something on that? Oh yeah. Here we go. Katusha's punk group. Would love to have seen them. The beasts. <laughs> okay. But we get that. So yay. That is for us. And then what we were able to freshen up. Really quick. Three washes with the water. <laughs> and she still looks just as dirty after doing this as she does before. So I don't know how that helped us any, but all right. At least you can see a reflection in the mirror. Mad props for that. Most games don't put it in. It's just a blurry thing. 
Uh-oh. That's right, there goes the guard. Better not forget your good luck, Char. Don't think I've ever seen you without it. That's all I got left. I think I was supposed to sit on the on the bed. Ah, yeah. So there's this. We can't do anything with it. And I think this is the thing she took out of the mechanical um, thing of hers. Yeah, it's his heart. So maybe it has some information on it or something. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I saw something up here. Did I read that before? Oh, yeah, yeah, I did. Okay. So I did. That was just the rules here. And then let's do our introspection real quick. God, another day of hard labor. What are you going to do now, Kate? Jeez, can't believe it's been almost a year since the militia sent me here. Gotta get out, move on. Whatever that might be. But how, though? No news from outside? Nothing. Does anyone even know I'm here? For Christ's sake, someone must be looking for me, mustn't they? Mustn't they? Alright, so get ready for work. I guess we need to tell her Don't forget it's your time game. to go. Yeah. We'll need it in Gallery C. And I don't think there was... Oh, wait. What was over here? Oh, take our gear. There we go. Glad you're here. Let's stay close, Katusha. Okay. Team Blue! Hey, you've got mail. It's for you, Americanska. Thanks. No stalling you here. I... you got five minutes to see what's inside. Or else, a less friendly pace will come to get you. Hmm. Yeah. Whoever sent you that parcel must have gone to a lot of trouble getting it to you. Yeah, definitely. I'm surprised they didn't keep that. The the first to my brother, I used to play with it when I was a kid. And then we can turn it this on. This melody stuck with me throughout my childhood. Remember, even my mother couldn't find out what it was called. Is that the musical score she played to to um for the the clock? Maybe. So a boarding pass doesn't have a date on it. If it does, I don't see it. Yeah, date closed, 2005, but it's 2004, right? Huh, okay. And then where, how do I get, that was added, my, the plane ticket was added to my documents and there's no letter? Oh, there it is, right here. Olivia Foster, New York. What could she have sent me given our dispute after my leaving with Hans? Strange. What? August 23rd, 2003. Dear Kate, wherever you are now, despite the sad news it contains, I hope this letter reaches you in time for you to make preparations to return to New York. Your mother, Sarah Walker, passed away last night at Mount Sinai Hospital. She had been doing poorly for several months and her death was no doubt a release. The 
funeral will take place Thursday, next week. We push back the ceremony so you can be with us. If I'm not mistaken, returning to the United States means you run the risk of having to answer to the law. Sometimes it's better to pay your debts to society instead of being forever on the run. And for once, just put aside those senseless, adventurous pretensions of yours. They've already cost you your friends and family. I beg you, Kate, please come back and say goodbye to your mother. Call me so we can organize your return in the best conditions possible. I've enclosed your mother's pendant. According to her, you used to love the mystery of its melody. I promised her I would send it to you. Call me for the sake of what's left of our friendship. Olivia, 212-359-1519. Bang. I feel so bad for her there. I really, really do. Oh, man. To find out well done, Dan, over a year dear. after I'm your mother so was gone your that she passed. The Academy of Music. It would be heartbreaking. We shall find a pretty frame for your diploma. Thank you, Mother. Once you've finished your studies at the Academy of Music next year, you'll be able to start higher education at the Paris Conservatory. Won't she, Anton? Of course. Of course. Then, my darling, you'll become a great concert pianist. You make us so proud, doesn't she, Anton? Uh, of course. Uh, of course. <laughs> so proud. He sounds like a yes to your person. I can't wait to see the Paris Conservatory, even though I'll miss you both terribly. And it's perhaps not such a bad idea for you to move away from Wagen. Times are hard at the moment for people like us. <coughs> I do worry about your health still. Thankfully, Herr Gustav agreed to take you on at the mountain refuge this summer. Oh, yes. That mountain air will do you a world of good, my dear. By the way, did you write to Herr Gustav to thank you? Oh, uh, well, I was very busy rehearsing the concert, you know. The gentleman is offering you a job, Dana. Thanking him is the very least you can do. Yes, Mother, I'll do it right away. <laughs> That's how I always was when I was a kid. My mom said, did you write your grandmother a thank you letter for sending you a Christmas present? No, Mom, I will, though. <laughs> so I think what I want to do for this, since we've already seen all this, I don't want to, like, put you through watching the whole demo again right up front. So I'm going to go ahead and divide it into two pieces. This will be the first part. I'm going to quit it here. And then in the next one, we'll finish up the demo section, see if there was anything added that I might have missed when I was playing through it. And then we can get on in the third episode, I think, with all the game that we haven't seen yet. I am very much looking forward to that. Thanks to everyone who said that they had enjoyed the demo and wanted to see more. I know I've fallen in love with the game. so. But yeah, that is going to be it for me for the day. So thank you all so very much for joining me. I've been Volker. I hope you guys have enjoyed. And I hope I'll see you in the next one.